holiday spirit finds its way into everything from the decor in our homes to the music on our radios and one of my faves, the taste of the holidays in your coffee. Jackie Danker's brewing up some ways to jazz up your Java holiday style. It's cold outside, so let's warm up with some festive coffee. People get excited about the seasonal drinks. It signifies like, okay, it's holiday season, let's do this. Time to celebrate yeah. and be caffeinated. To show us how we can make some holiday joe at home, we caught up with owner of Cafe Vita, Deming McLeese. Starting with a peppermint mocha. So first you just start with a couple of tablespoons of Peppermint tea, it's like holiday time. In yes. a can. Yes. <laughs> Into a tea steeper it goes, followed by hot water and sugar. Let's steep for 30 minutes, and then you have peppermint, peppermint syrup. syrup. Then grab a shot of espresso. So what if we only have drip coffee? Does that work too? Drip coffee works great. Awesome. Yeah, you're just going to have more coffee in there than espresso. Squirt in your peppermint syrup and some chocolate syrup. Oh my gosh. Give it a stir. Then you're gonna put some hot milk in there. Wow. You're kidding me. Is this yeah. your first day here? It's my second day. <laughs> Add a festive candy cane, some crushed ones in the cup, and there you have it. I think Santa would be really excited if he got this. Oh, so good. Now we are making a super simple honey cinnamon coffee. You can just use like ingredients that you should have at home. already at home. So grab your favorite cup of coffee. Put in some honey. It's got some earthy notes in there. Toss in some cinnamon and whisk. The simple ingredients that really just take it up a notch. Add in some cream or milk. Which makes it a little richer. Okay. And of course, some whipped cream. It looks like hot cocoa, but it's our coffee. Yep. Top it with more honey and cinnamon and enjoy. That is so good. All right. You're gonna have a great day if you that, start your day with that. Yes. Finally, gather around the fire for an eggnog latte. You know the holidays are here when eggnog comes out. If you're doing it at home, you can use espresso or you can just use drip coffee. We went with drip coffee. Then pour in your eggnog. I have it heated up a little bit here so you can steam it or just heat it on the stove. For some sweetness, pour in some maple syrup. Stir, and then? Nutmeg and cinnamon. I can smell that. Yes. And inquiring minds had to ask. Can it be a coffee cocktail? Fun thing about eggnog is it goes really well with a little booze in there. I would say you could use some rum or some brandy. Ooh. That would be really tasty. Yeah. Top with some whipped cream, more nutmeg, cinnamon, and syrup. Where are the pancakes at? <laughs> and sip away. Oh, that is heavenly. All right. Making our days merry and bright with holiday coffee.